the progress that I have made so far on my personal tree skirt church finished and I'm moving this direction in the pattern try to get a little bit of a close-up here I have this other house is also finished um, I'm working on the snow and the little snowman that's gonna go here and then I'll continue around the pattern here. Fair amount of detail in this one. There's one more building over here on this side. And then that's it for the buildings. It's just trees and snowmen the rest of the way around. <clears throat> There's the church. See where the snowman's gonna be right there. Thing on top of that patch of snow. But even these side houses are quite detailed. <coughs> Lots of fun to do. Lots of sequins, my favorite. Here it is. I have finished the Christmas Village felt Christmas tree skirt um, and it's ready to go on my tree but I just thought I'd give you a quick look at it I have uh, some progression videos that I'll add here to this but let's get a little up close get me out of the way it started with the church which I think was a great place to start. And it has so many layers and details. Um, it just turned out really lovely. Next to the church is a little, little snowman and a Christmas tree. And farther down the road, looks like it must be somebody's house. There are trees all along. Over here on the other side of the church is another little house. So there's a total of three houses on this skirt. And then as you continue around, you see there are winter trees and uh, pine trees. Let me flip it over for you. There's more snowmen. A total of three snowmen on the whole skirt. A total of six of these um, kind of winter trees that lost their leaves. A total of six of this size of Christmas tree. No, I'm sorry, eight because there's one next to each snowman. And then there's two of these larger, a little bit larger Christmas trees here on this edge right here. They give you a total of about 10 or 12 of these um, snowflakes and it's up to you to decide where you want to place them. If I can get this back <laughs> how I had it so you can see uh, the uh, buildings. So that's pretty much what it ends up looking like. Try to get it here where you can see them all. The church and two houses, and then trees, snowmen, 
and Christmas trees all around the base. I will try to get you a couple of shots of it once I get it placed on my tree uh, with my little table and everything and get it all set up. But I'm thrilled. It uh, turned out beautifully, I think. Um, it looks really great. I have two um, details that you should know in review on this pattern. Number one, I was seriously, seriously short of white floss. And you can see all of the white has to be applied with white floss. All of the white sequins need white floss. And um, all of the white embroidery around the snow, I probably had half the floss that I needed. So if you plan to make this skirt, uh, make sure that you've got some extra white floss on hand in case you have the same problem. Now, I do choose to do all of these sequins and knot them rather than drag the floss because I don't want it to be caught or pulled. So maybe that was why, I don't know. Um, certainly, uh, I would be first to say it's probably me, user error as opposed to the kit error, but just something to know. <clears throat> and the last thing that it tells you to do um, on your instructions are these two snowmen. However, it omits this Christmas tree that's next to him. That's a 90 something number and it stops with, um, I think these are 94, 95, 96, 97. Um, and sorry, these is nine, the tree is 94, 95, 96, 97. Um, and it has no directions for those. However, you have done six of these trees that are almost the same. So you certainly know how to do it. And when you've got a couple of bits of felt left, you know you need to put them where they are marked to go. So not a big deal. Um, certainly an easy solution, um, you know, to that. Uh, but just a heads up that, that I did notice that. Other than that, let me, I don't think, other than that, there weren't any other details or review items that I thought necessary for people to know. Uh, before they make the skirt um, it it does it works up nice it is fun to do um, I enjoyed it quite a bit and I really love how it looks when I put it on the little table with my small Christmas tree so I'll give you a, a peek at that when I get that there thanks so much have a blessed holiday season